Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Next level is Riverside Race. Now this level quite literally is a race to the finish. Like see that at the bottom right corner they're flashing 1 minute 15 seconds. You gotta make it to the end of the level before then and the bees behind you will most certainly encourage you to do so. <laughs> Yeah, oh, and the bees, they can't go in the water. See, they kind of flutter away. But anyway, you want to do two uh, runs on this level. One where you just complete the, the level normally, you know, where you aim to 100% it. And then another time where you aim to beat that time record. You'll see why. And I'm going to do that record a little bit later on when I meet the bear who lives in this world. Let's just put it that way. Run, 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 go, 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 go. And you're gonna need to master Kitty Kong's water skipping move too, because there are some sections like, look at that over there. See, you can't quite, can't quite get up there with Dixie. Oh, please, please leave me alone, bees. I just wanna get to a point where I can do that. There we go. <laughs> Yeah, you can manipulate the bees' movements by jumping over them at the right time, basically. I mean, the- oh shoot. The bees aren't as much of a threat as you might think they are, basically. Anyway, I should switch- whoops. Oh shoot. I was just gonna say I should switch back over to, um... Uh, Kitty Kong- I mean Dixie Kong so I don't take a hit on my way back around, but eh, It's not that difficult of a level as long as you keep moving, but uh, yeah, I just wanna get up to here, there we go, because there's a bonus barrel up here, look at that! <laughs> By far, Kitty Kong is the most important character uh, of this level 4, 100%ing it. And look at this, we got a Coco just right here in the middle of everything, just waiting for you to make a mistake and landing into it without jumping, I mean, swimming quick enough. Yeah, that is... One inconvenient fish. <laughs> nope, 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 not gonna happen. Nope, still not gonna happen. Yeah, the time is a little bit tighter on this one than it is in comparison to other ones because, you know, we're getting a little bit later in the game here. So, yeah, anyway, that one is completed and I should get in the water. <laughs> there be bees. I'm gonna go down through here to show you what we missed. It's not really all that much. That's that's the ledge that we, uh, we were just up on. <clears throat> Excuse me. And now, we're going out of the water, into danger zone, oh good run, 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 go, 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 yeah, okay, we're safe, we're safe again, sort of, kind of, Ooh. yeah, I'm glad the bees cannot go in the water, they don't really look like bees, but they sound like bees, so I'm taking them as bees, and they hurt when they touch you, so, yeah, I would say they're bees, <laughs> uh, I need to get up there, and I think the bees give me a break here, just for a bit so I can do so, yeah, as a one-up. Now, I was actually looking for, um, coin, not for a one-up. Whoa! I can't have you hit me at this point. There's no checkpoints when you're playing with the toughest coat on. Yeah, there's some bananas down there. I think on opposite corners. Yep, right there. And yeah, I'm just going by stuff that I have uh, in memory here. Uh, oh yeah, um, those, those. Yeah, you gotta get that. Bouncy, 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 yeah, and then go up here and you'll find another bonus barrel. Isn't that nice? <laughs> Invincibility... Phone is ringing. Invincibility barrels are the only, th I mean, one of the few things that can kill off those uh, red-colored buzzes. And anyway, I gotta pause the game here. <laughs> gotta answer the phone, be right back. Okay, where was I? Probably killing baddies in a bonus area. Yes, of course. How could I have forgotten? Okay, I didn't forget it all, but I'm just trying to be careful here. There we go. Got that coin like no one's business. Now, what do we miss? So oh, shoot! Poopers! <laughs> well... I start out coming back from a phone call well, and then... Now I'm restarting the level from the very beginning. Great. <laughs> the good news is, though, the um, level is relatively short, though, and I can I can pretty much race through everything here, <laughs> as it is designed for, I guess you could say, gameplay flow, in that everything just keeps going forward. You can just keep holding forward, and then just react to threats as you go, either by rolling into them or jumping over them. 
So yeah, it's a pretty nice level overall in terms of flow. Like, look at this, I'm already back to about where I was before. Because this was... wait, did I go up here? Oh yeah, I did, that was for the extra life. Please, no bees. Okay, thank you. I like how the bees just give me a little break there, because they know I have to go back for that one-up. They give me a chance, I suppose. <laughs> Letter N, or, okay, there we go, this is the spot, because the invincibility barrel was back there, and then I passed through here, and I should actually switch over to Dixie, because I just don't want to lose, there we go, I don't want to lose uh, Kitty Kong, basically. Please don't hurt me, please don't hurt me no more, okay, I think, yep, okay, after this point, you're going to get to a sign that says no bees, I think, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, or not. Or... Oh, oh, oh! Poopers! Okay, I'll see you back at the end. Seriously? Jeez, that was close. <laughs> anyway, I'm coming up to the end of the level here, and... That's why I need to get up there, because coin is up there! Dang it! Alright, here we are. I skipped the end. Eh. Okay, it went away. Or not. Ah, I, I forgot how to do this. <laughs> I I think you gotta get him to despawn by going over to the side. And then having them spawn behind you like that. Yeah. See, the, the idea at this end part here is to get him behind you so that you can actually make this jump with Kitty Kong. Because watch, once you get to a certain point, they're going to disappear. See that? Look at that, look at that. See that? <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna have to have Kitty Kong out. Max out that running, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! Yeah! Ooh, made it! And give me that coin! Oh, yeah! There we go, now it's 100%ed. Get to that end, get to that end! Now remember that time for later though, that 1 minute and uh, 15 seconds with BR next to it? Because that is indeed something that is important for 100%ing this game. Next level, squeals on wheels. I'm pretty sure you know what they're talking about when they say squeals. So you've got these little gauges on the wall here, and when you kill all the rats in this area, you'll see at the gauge, it fills up the green, and then you'll be able to open up whatever door you need to open up. Well, there's a really special door right here, right at the beginning which doesn't open up until much, much later, so... I'm gonna have to play patiently to get through this bad boy. Oh yeah. Oh, by the way, I forgot to show this. If you jump on the barrel, yeah, you can do that when it's rolling around. <laughs> I don't really find this all that useful in uh, uh, most circumstances, but it is something that you can do. And also, I would like to keep uh, both partners here to be able to get up to spots like that. Um, you know, just in case. So I'm gonna play extra conservative because I'm, I'm pr almost positive there is something in this level that I need to throw up, throw a partner up to, and yeah, to reach it. Hey, uh, where's the, oh, right here? I was gonna say, what's what's down here? I don't remember there being a split path. It's probably because I don't uh, have to go down here. <laughs> it's just like the punishment path, I suppose. I'm just going to leave you behind because you are pretty much invulnerable. Also notice that there are these uh, locked trap doors here. See that? See that? See that? Those will be unlocked once you are able to unlock that big door. I should say that one door way, way at the beginning. Um, the, actually, the second door at the beginning. And yeah, there's a bonus up here. That one's pretty easy to get to with any Kong. 20 stars. Can I do it? Probably. Not. Okay, I don't really. Probably. Oh, I hate this one star in the middle, though. Eh. Hold on. Oh, I was gonna say I'm gonna try and get it with Dixie Kong by switching and, you know, doing a helicopter, but I couldn't switch in there for some reason. Hold on, I'm gonna just do a little, little thingamabob here outside the bonus area, because I think Dixie Kong will make it a trivial jump to get that one star in the center. So let's just see here. I'll, I'll aim to get that one right off the bat. Yeah, that makes it so, so much easier. <laughs> but it's possible to do with Kitty Kong too. It's just awkwardly precise because the hit, I, I should say the platforms of those squeal wheels are 
really weird. I, it's hard to describe how they're like, but they're, they don't... The, the, the surface just isn't what it looks like. Anyway, it looks like I have filled up the gauge and I'm now able to go on ahead here. Look at this huge gauge here. It's completely in the red. Yeah! And I'm pretty sure I want to go up here for something. Yes! That's why I needed both Kongs. 15 bananas. Can I do it? Will I do it? Now, this, this is the same layout as the other one, except it's with bananas, but not stars. Well, for the most part. <laughs> I mean, yeah, there's no stars, but what I mean is that it's it's the same sort of jumping shenanigans that we went through before, but the right side seems a little different. I think they extended that side a little bit. Maybe. Not sure, really. <laughs> anyway, it's pretty easy. It's not like getting that star, grrr. I know I could have rolled off the edge and gotten that star, um, you know, like, bleh, like that, but as I said, the, the, um, the landing area, these things are really weird, like, watch this, see that, look at that, I'm on, see that? Isn't that off? <clears throat> Isn't that off, excuse me? Just, just watch this. If you stand on the center, you're fine, but look at that, look at that, it's like only the very, very center of this is stand onable if that makes sense. <laughs> I, I don't know why, but yeah, that's a pretty good way to show it, I suppose. <laughs> By, you know, purposely falling off at a safe area. Um, I'm gonna need to do a careful barrel throw here. Yeah, got it. And then over here, I could actually... Oh no, that's not good. That's not good. How could I have made such a horrible mistake? How? Oh. I really hope I didn't need Kitty Kong for anything else. Like, I hope I did- Oh, no. I probably needed to get up there. Poopers. And I- You know, there's no Donkey Kong barrels here, too. Oh, jeez. And this is gonna be really difficult to get through with, uh, Dixie Kong. Oh, well, it's possible. <laughs> Actually, since I'm probably gonna have to get up there, you know what I should do? That. <laughs> <laughs> I've got 32 lives anyway. Well, had 32 lives. Oh, great. Oh, yeah, I can't start select out because I haven't beaten the level yet. Stupendous. Combo attack. Anyway, we're back over here. And this time I have both Kongs. I really should take my own advice and be more careful from here on out. Yep, there's coin. That's all I needed to get up here. Voila. Wait, is there anything else? Just out of curiosity here. I'm going to throw a Kong around here. I don't really feel like checking every aerial area. Just that it's so wide that it feels like that there should be something up there. I don't know. <laughs> and this is a lot easier with Kitty Kong because he's got the um, lower holding posture. And this is probably easier with Dixie Kong. Now you might want to switch Kongs as you go, you know, just to be safe. Possibly, maybe, but it's up to you. Uh, did I miss something up here? Maybe I did. Hold on, I just want to make sure... Okay, yeah, it's, it's clear up there. Just gotta be sure. Do you really want me to restart the level again? Okay, you probably do, but really, I don't want to restart the level, so, haha. <laughs> oh, 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 I got it. I heard the sound effect. Uh, what, what? I, I heard. Did I kill one of them away from there some somehow? What? Anyway, I'm gonna throw her up there and see if there's anything of worth. No. Yeah, I must have killed something over here. Maybe. I shouldn't say must because I'm not positive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, rolling is a pretty good defensive tactic versus them. Okay, the gauge is almost full. Very close to being able to finish this level, oh boy! Are you excited to see how this is going to play out? Look at this, look at this. Now all the gates are unlocked. Are you ready? Free fall! Woo! <laughs> brilliant level design there. Absolutely brilliant. Alright, now we got Perry the Parakeet here. New animal buddy. It collects stuff and it can also kill certain enemies like booty birds like that. 
But you gotta look out for certain stuff like, say that, but when you take it to this particular sign, you get a whopping three up balloon. Yep, all those lives that I lost from my mishaps replaced. <sighs> And there we go. Level is now 100%ed. Should you, I really need to show you more Swanky Sideshow? I don't think so. So let's move on to Springin' Spiders. This is basically the level 4 Nid. And I also, I, by the way, I should mention, these levels, really beautiful looking in general, by the way. Just a really nice design. Oh yeah. By the way, uh, that, that was a Bristles enemy. They, there's also a rolling version of it that's much, much more difficult to deal with, but yeah. Wait, do you harm me if you... Oh no, you're not the kind that harms me. It's just the uh, other kind. Uh, the pinkish one. Yeah, the yellow ones, they're pretty happy. Although, oh yeah, uh, I was gonna say, although they can hinder you if they break barrels like what happened there, but <laughs> it's too late now. It's not that big of a deal, though. I don't think anything was uh, hidden there. Because uh, what we're going to have to do is uh, go around this way. Anyway, there's a squawks barrel right here. This is for something up through here. Yes, squawks the parrots. If you flap with the jump button, you go higher. You can also um, shoot out eggs by pressing the run button, which is handy for... Come on, just... Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm, get mm, there we go <laughs> there's a bonus barrel in here which is why I needed squawks Whoa, spooky. 15 bananas await us well they just oh no 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 are you oh oh no oh no uh wait where's the barrel where is how far back am I? Okay, I'm not that far back. Wait, maybe you don't harm. Uh, oh, well, there we go. <laughs> well, maybe I didn't need squawks for that, because I'm pretty sure that pathway is a, a pathway that the Kongs can reach. Anyway, I guess the, it was nice to show the the secret of that, that squawks is in this level at all. Oh, shoot. Ah, this one's so mean, because you gotta loop around red buzz and you can't kill it off with your eggs <laughs> I hate you so much but at least you don't take me too far back not too far <laughs> oh, and I wonder if I should just like, grab this letter now right away Bloop. just as long as I have easy access to it with ye old parrot Whoa. Here we go. <laughs> well, maybe this is a squawks area then, because um, maybe I'm thinking of it's another area. I mean, I was confusing this with another area because if you look, there's no way I'd be able to do this bonus area if I wasn't squawks. <laughs> and also, holding down makes you fall faster. By the way, that's how I'm able to get these bananas with uh, relative ease before they disappear. You can let a few one, few of them go. This one's pretty lenient. I was just being Way too reckless for my own good. There we go. Bonus coin. Get. Alright, now let's finish off this particular side. And uh, if you somehow came across the sign from the other side, you'd be like, Oh, well, what am I supposed to do here? I'm kind of puzzled as to... I mean, I see the sign, but I can't do anything about that. And yeah, where does the paths um, cr crisscross over anyway? Uh, maybe I can't go back because of that buzz, at least not without taking a hit, and it's not really worth it, especially since I have to go through here with uh, squawks anyway, and you have to as well, so... No, that frightens me! <laughs> Don't like when they do that. Please go straight up. Okay. Uh, always gotta time yourself with the junk that's in your way. Oh yes. By the way, if you didn't realize, um, these shorter-ended carvings out of the tree here you can go through from below but the ones that are wider like the ones to the ones to the left you cannot so yeah just keep in, keep that in mind so you don't accidentally jump yourself into something that you don't want to jump yourself into wow you are hyper <laughs> Wee, oh. 
do I want to do I want to go up there? I'm not sure. I probably do. <laughs> There's a bear coin. Maybe I need to throw someone up there. No. There's bananas. Where is coin located in this level? I forgot. Cuz I'm pretty sure I got all the bonus areas if I recall correctly. <laughs> oh shoot. I think I needed that barrel. I think I not a maybe maybe not. Mm, I'm not sure. I guess we'll find out soon. Oh, okay. There. Wait, wait. Is that coin over there? It looks like it is. Uh, hold on. Don't move too far ahead. Gotta find the way over there. My voice is getting higher. Um, what if I drop down here? That's useless to me. <laughs> well, now I took a hit, but hopefully I don't need a buddy to get wherever coin is. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking that is the way back, that where that T. Oh shoot, where that TNT barrel was. Well, it looks like I'm gonna have to do this level over anyway, because it appears that I missed the opportunity to get wherever coin was. Ah, I just I don't remember where where the spot was, but. Or maybe I do, maybe maybe it was that, um, as I said, I thought I needed to use that barrel, but I just wasn't sure where. Well, in any case, I'm able to now show you the uh, alternate paths, I suppose, through the level here, you know, without taking the squawks route, and I still miss out on that bear coin. I just never learn, do I? Um, Alright, so, over here is where the other route would come from. Well, eventually. You miss out on quite a lot when you use squat. Oh shoot. <laughs> I hate how they break the barrels. You miss out on quite a lot uh, over well maybe not that much because I'm already re rejoining the path where squawks uh, met up with you. But you do miss out on a good portion of the level by using squawks. There we go. There's the signpost. Now I need need to figure out what I have to do here again. I mean, I, you know, I've 100% at the game before. Well, technically 105% at the game before, but you know what I'm, you know what I'm saying here and that I got everything. Uh, you're frightening. You're very frightening in fact. Okay, I'm going to try and keep this barrel with me and see you son of a <laughs> <sighs> Well, maybe... Eh, I don't know. Wait, wait, oh, 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 okay, okay, okay. I see. It jumps extra high because... Mm! Yes! Yes! Now I'll be able to throw this up there, hopefully. Uh, maybe I don't have to switch Kongs. Uh, can I switch Kongs up? You're not letting me switch Kongs? Oh, there we go. Just can't be away. I mean, can't can't be by a wall, basically. Yeah, got it. And now I will try to switch again. There we go. Because I gotta have Dixie be at the front of the line to be able to do that. And this is where the paths join up, where I seen that TNT barrel before. Ha ha ha! Now the level should be 100%ed. Hopefully. <laughs> Never underestimate the power of forgetting. <laughs> you gotta get this guy to go up here in order to get this N over here if you care about that. And there's also one up there. This rejoins this lower path here. Uh, if you don't take that, you would have to... Yeah, either. Wait, what's down here? Oh, it's just a punishment of sorts. Yeah, kind of. But that barrel cannon is there so you don't get... Oh, shoot! Stuck endlessly. Yeah. Maybe, oh no, please tell, tell me I need this barrel somewhere. Do I? I'm not sure. I'm frightened to use the barrel. <laughs> just keep the barrel with me. I know there's one here, but just for safety's sake. Whee! Okay, I gotta get to over to the right. I know I'm playing super cautious and cowardly here, but this is a long level. Oh, I lost the barrel, but well... Maybe it won't matter. Oh, wait, you respawned over there already? Wow. <laughs> Please. Oh, 
Yes! That is a swoopy, and they can be used to get up to higher spots, yeah. I know I skipped out on the O there, but eh. oh well. Wait, what's down here? I don't trust what's... Bonus. Okay, so I did forget about a bonus area in this level. Good thing I went down here. 30 stars. Can I do it? Maybe. Got it. Yeah! If I didn't do that helicopter spin, I would have had to loop around, but I was able to do that without uh, much issue. I'm so scared, mommy. <laughs> okay, okay, is everything safe? Is everything... Everything's clear? Everything's fine? The flag on the flagpole looks like it's going to fly full mast. I got coin. It's 100%! <laughs> oh, and with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part. Let's see what Wrinkly's doing at the save cave. Just end off this working out, maybe? What was that? You'd like to change your name? Oh, sorry I misheard. You want to save your game? Yes! Toodaloo! -do -do. <laughs> Good advice.